It's game over on the first two stages. This is gonna be a beautiful LP, in case you can't tell. This is probably gonna be the most amazing one. So you unlock two lines and you can view them on a deep metro station. And stations marked with the, uh, the pulse setting uh, contains one of the things, uh, one of the four things. So you can see that station A isn't a thing. It ain't no thing. <laughs> <laughs> but station B is a thing. I love this. Ooh, by the way, while you've been out there passing tests, Captain Kelfish has some time on his hands, so we've been chatting with him. We thought you might be interested, so we made a chat log viewable to you. Use L and R to select the chat logs on your CQ80. Take a look sometime. This is actually, I'm actually going to do that. I enjoy the lore for this. Session 1. Webmaster DJ Hyperfresh has joined the chat room. DJ Hyperfresh. Hey, anyone here yet? Hello. Uh, Webmaster MC Princess has joined the chat room. Hey, yo, it's Pearl, a.k.a. MC, MC Princess, a.k.a. The Baroness of Bars, a.k.a. MC Foreign Policy. Um, a.k.a. Pillsbury Dope Boy. <laughs> <laughs> da, da, da. Oh snap, it's Marina. Hey Pearl, aka DJ Hyperfresh, aka DJ Cold Breakfast, aka the Fuzzy Dazzler, aka Dutch DJ Catch and Release, aka Lewis Rich. <laughs> oh my god. Craig Kellerfish has joined the chat room. Dude's screen name is just his first and last name. Gotta love old people, lol. Hi, Captain Cuttlefish. Can you see the chat room okay on your cell phone? I can see it just fine, but thanks for ash asking. But all my letters are big for some reason. Hit the cops caps lock key cap. Uh, it should be the button on in the lower left, depending on your on your phone. By the way, I was able to hack into the CQ80, so H and H should be able to see our chat logs. Test one. Test. I am Cuttlefish. Agent 8, we'll send you a dump of our latest chat logs every few stages. Keep an eye out. Yo, Cap, how do you even type like that? You gotta show me. <laughs> so it's like those old school IRC uh, chats or like Zat. Those, anybody been on Zat.com? I was. I was actually uh, avidly on Zat.com. I used to role play as a robot master back in those days. Can you believe that? Back in early YouTube days, I want to say about 2010. 2008 2008 or 10 I've been on YouTube a very long time <laughs> bounce with me station blaster and splat thingy all right so blaster is still really cool this is uh, good for accuracy so if you hit those direct shots it like does like oh, good damage like an insta kill almost every time but you have to have like that um hit that sweet spot all right, um, I just tried to aim. All right, Ooh. I keep forgetting we're time, so I need to hurry up. All these, uh, are, I think, are time. I think if you hit right there, never mind. Yeah, that was one bullet, right? <laughs> All right. Oh no, instincts hold B to jump over them. Yeah, they're not an insta kill, so I wouldn't be like extremely terrified of them if you do hit them, because you do have like the um the health system. All right, so we got checkpoints. Uh, I should be jumping through these, but there's like, there's actually no point to money. <laughs> Besides, test retries. Thought you could get that like that. But um, yeah. <gasps> oh wait, I don't know why I'm freaking out. This is what that is. All right, there we go. That's perfectly filled. We got the key for this, so we should be able to super jump to the next spot. Also, I can't tell what this background is. Uh, it looks like fishing hooks. That's why I want to say it is, but I know it's wrong. Ooh, sniper. All right, so we could use just our, Z and our ZL to hide. No, no, that's not. Ooh. There we go. Had to two shot him. All right. Ooh, okay. Um. Can I grab that with that? Nope, I have to wait. I just tried this like five seconds ago. That's the funny part. I'm gonna preemptively shoot this. Preemptively shoot that. All right, there we go. 
Now with that under us, just keep moving. Huh. No. All right, now we're in the one-shot range. Okay. Unless our armor repunishes right before it makes circle. Nope. It didn't. All right. You move slow when you do that, too. I also got it. No! All right. Get over that. No! Okay. All right, let's see. Go inside. <laughs> <laughs> I'll attack it head on and I finally hit the sweet spot too. I finally hit the sweet spot There we go. I used to play blaster a lot man. I just need to get Get my aim to get we're just coming out of retirement for a lot of stuff besides overwatch We're not coming out of retirement for that yet because I just actually just quit that not too long ago but Eventually maybe Eventually. Ooh, and this guy. He looks like one of those uh, trilobites, I want to say. He's probably like a sea critter that I don't pay attention to. Because a lot of sea critters, once you get down to that deep stuff, start looking really weird. And I don't like my fish when they look weird. They're scary. They're super scary. Uh, beg your pardon, young swire. Might I have a look at those trinkets you got here? This is still being recorded in Spook Month, by the way. So I'm going to still count those as spooky scary. Skeletons, forgive me if I caught you off guard. I'm um, hope I'm not too off-putting for the child. After I just said that these things are scary, they know. They call me Isopadre. That's not my name, mind you, but it's the only one I recall now. Dang, dude, when you're so old that you forget your own name, down in here we call those thin slices of memory mem cakes. You know, I spent an age or two down here, and the deaf's hungry for them. They're my only link left. At least I still remember my own days as a test subject, though I washed out early. Don't worry, I'm gonna suck so hard that you're probably gonna stand a better chance than I do. I pray that you'll be the one to cut through the gloom and light the way to my dreams. Share your mem cakes with me and I will pay the favor. Safe travels, young swear. Alright, so first up, um, let me offer some apologies. Uh, the footage for most of these levels died like died all right so <laughs> this is how much i got into recording before it died an hour in not like an hour in 30 minutes in so we're going to be doing all these stages again well you won't be seeing it. it'll be the first time because i'll be doing all these stages again so um sorry about that um also another thing is i got sick <laughs> during the last recording session too so this is not not a good time for the bear. Not only did the footage die, Moon Bear started dying. <laughs> it's okay. I still kind of feel sick, but um, I brought myself some water to counteract the the city and my uh my body, the acid in my body that's trying to escape my body via my throat. All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and do this. Whoa. I need to stop flick shooting these. Like, come on. I'm trying to flick shoot in the jetpack. A projectile weapon. Oh, that was a good flick shot. I don't know why I did that. There we go. Oh. I didn't lead the shot enough. I was like practicing uh, normal tear for it. Oh my goodness. It took me a good while. Of course, my aim might be a little bit better now. <laughs> Ooh! I almost killed myself. Okay. There we go. Just gonna go ahead and do that as safely as possible. There we go. Send, bring me over here. But yeah. So um, since I, I've, I've gotten sick and come back, we're no longer in spook, spook month. We're in uh, we're in my month, the birth month of the bear. So uh, yeah, and then the smash direct happened, and I was like, you know what? I'm content. Ah! I dying. Let me just go ahead and do this. Whoa, okay. Alright, let's see. I love how we don't have to worry about the stuff on the ground because, of, you know, the whole, um. Ooh, hello, guy. Way too close for my comfort. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. And the worst part about it is, like, I already did the sniper challenge, that really hard one. Not the really hard one, one of the really hard ones. So nobody will be able to know that I did it like on 
one of my first few tries. That footage is dead, unfortunately. And I know exactly what caused it, too. It is, I didn't compress the audio properly. That was my fault. I let, I let the thing. I was being, I was, I was being careless. That was me. That was me. All right. So I've done that, cause I just, I just edit these videos, so I know exactly which ones I have done and which ones I haven't done. And by know exactly which ones I've done and not done, I mean I have a somewhat decent clue. <laughs> Alright, uh, yeah, I think I'm ready. This one wasn't too hard, if I remember right. There we go. Ooh, it bounced off me. Alright, can I get close enough? No, don't push me back. I forgot, I could go in and, like, <laughs> store the charge. I forgot that was one of the buffs to sniping in uh, Splatoon. That was weird, when I was practicing Splatoon, nobody was sniping. That's like a, a weird thing. It's like a mixed bag when it comes to snipers in Splatoon 2. It's like they either suck or they'll be like the best snipers in the world. Now, the best snipers in the world always seem to be on the enemy teams. Isn't that like the good old the good old stigma? Sigma. Woo! No. Don't do that. Ooh! Stop that. You're scaring my ball. Me bola! Ah! Alright, there we go. There. Can I just go on this side and, and shoot it? Uh oh. Mr. Key? Okay, never mind. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Mr. Key! <laughs> no! Alright, so. I think I just need to push it and not be crazy. I think that would be probably the best thing to do. All right, perfect. All right. Go ahead and do that. Go. Ooh! I thought I messed that up, but it was grinding. Oh, wait, what? Wait, where did it go? Oh. Leave it alone. Don't shoot my thing. Don't shoot my thing, sir. <gasps> oh, no. Okay. I was about to freak out. But yeah, I've been fine. Uh, other than like the sickness, I've been doing pretty good. I've been watching uh, some Joel Joel. Getting caught up on that stuff. So I've been having a good time. It's been good. My work has been kept keeping me busy, which is good. Which means my Christmas will be fine. Which I really don't do much for Christmas besides like buy it for other people because everything I want I already buy all right so um, oh there it is I was like waiting for it. I was like I know there's a thing that goes right here there we go but you guys are distracted by that which is there we go look dude I'm gonna need you guys to stop using your face to block my ball there we go ah oh, haha there we go. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Just give him a nice little shot to finish him off. All right. Let's go back and pick up our ball. What are you doing, man? What are you doing, man? Get over there. Oh, that just slows it down? What? What? There we go. Sniping rule number one. Never just try to follow super hard like that. Unless you're like really good at it. I mean, I'm good at, like with tracking. At least with motion controls. But like I think like the best way to snipe is just to like wait until it gets into the scope and then shoot. Especially for something that moves unpredictable. Alright, sir. I need you to get over there. Yeah. <laughs> drink some water to counteract the toxin that's in my body that's slowly killing me <laughs> yo thank you for watching this video if you find yourself a fan of this content why not hit the subscribe button so you could be a part of the moon peeps because even though i call you peeps you are all my homies
If you're interested in more Moon Bear, why not follow me on Twitch for when we do our Twitch takeover? And why not follow me on Twitter as well? And if it was your birthday, happy birthday. Internet, you know where to find me. Thank you.